Tours. This is BBC News. I'm Laquesta Burek. The headlines at 10. Jeremy Corbyn says he would back another referendum on Brexit if Labour Party members vote for it at conference. I'm there elected uh, as a leader of this party, elected as the leader in order to bring greater democracy to this party. There will be clear votes in conference. I don't know what's going to come out of the, all the compositing meetings that are going on. Following EU leaders' rejection of Theresa May's Chequers plan last week, the Brexit sec secretary says he won't let the EU dictate negotiations. This is a bump in the road. We'll hold our nerve, we'll keep our call, cool, and we'll keep negotiating good faith. I think we need to keep these negotiations going. Iran's president accuses American-backed Gulf states of supporting groups behind a deadly terror attack on a military parade yesterday. And at 10.40 and again at 11.30, we'll be taking an in-depth look at the papers with our reviewers, former Fleet Street editor Eve Pollard and political correspondent at the FT, Laura Hughes, will be joining me. Do stay with us for that. Very good evening. Jeremy Corbyn has confirmed that Labour would support another referendum on Brexit if delegates backed the idea at the party's conference. He says he'd prefer a general election but would abide by the decision of members. His comments came as thousands of people joined an anti-Brexit march in Liverpool where the Labour conference is currently taking place. Here's our political correspondent, Alex Forsyth. <laughs> 